plants to attract butterflies to your garden. You may have heard that butterflies are the perfect choice for gardening. They're beautiful, colorful, and extremely beneficial to the environment. If you want to attract butterflies to your garden, you need to know what type of plants will work best. There are many types of plants that will attract butterflies. You can plant them in your backyard or you can put them in an outdoor butterfly habitat. You can even buy a butterfly garden kit to get started. The key to having a successful butterfly garden is to make sure that it has a variety of plants. If you only have one type of plant, you won't be able to attract all the different butterflies. 11 plants to attract butterflies to your garden. Here we are going to discuss 11 plants that you can use to attract butterflies to your garden. The list is not all inclusive. You can add more plants to your garden if you want to attract more butterflies. Some of these plants are easy to grow while others are more difficult. If you want to attract butterflies to your garden, it's important that you plant the right type of plants. So let's get started. 1. Butterfly Bush This is one of the best known plants to attract butterflies. The butterfly bush resembles a shrub in the shape of a bush with large spiky flowers. The flowers are either pink or white depending on the type of butterfly bush. This shrub provides nectar for many butterfly species including monarchs and swallowtails. The butterfly bush is a type of shrub that's easy to grow and can grow to about 10 feet tall. It's important to remember that butterflies like sunny areas. So if you put the butterfly bush in a sunny area, you have a better chance to attract butterflies to your garden. It's a spreading shrub, so it can become invasive if you're not careful. 2. Blazing Star Flowers Blazing star flowers are flowers that are commonly found in eastern Canada and the northeastern United States, the Midwest, the South, and the Great Plains. Blazing stars are considered butterfly weeds because they attract so many butterflies and moths. It is a perennial flowering plant and you can use it as a border for your garden. The flowers are pink and purple. The stems are tall and range from 16 to 20 inches. It grows well in USDA zones 3 to 9. The flowers attract butterflies like Monarch, Painted Lady, and Gulf Fritillary. 3. Coneflower or Echinacea A coneflower is a popular purple and yellow flowering plant. It's easy to grow and very attractive. It's a perennial and comes in a variety of colors. You can plant this plant in sunny or partially shaded areas and it attracts monarch and swallowtail butterflies. Some of the most common species of echinacea plants are purple coneflower, purple prairie coneflower, and black-eyed Susan. You can plant these flowers in the spring and enjoy the colorful butterflies in the garden for weeks. The flowers attract butterflies and pollinators and grow well in USDA zones 3 to 11. 4. Black-Eyed Susans Black-Eyed Susans are also known as Rudbeckia herda. They are annual flowering plants that are native to eastern and central North America. They're named to honor a Swedish botanist named Peter Rudbeck. These plants are mostly found in dry areas. They are drought tolerant and because of the presence of the black-eyed Susan flowers, they become a favorite of hummingbirds and butterflies. 5. Lavender Lavender is a nice addition to your garden, especially if you're looking to attract butterflies. It's a type of flowering plant that belongs to the mint family. There are many varieties of lavender. The most common ones are French, Spanish, and English. Lavender grows as a low bush or as a climbing plant. The flowers of the lavender plant come in many colors such as purple, blue, pink, and white. 6. Lantana Lantana is a fast-growing plant and once established, it can easily grow from 3 to 6 feet tall. It's also a butterfly magnet. Butterflies love nectar from the flowers of this plant. They are available in many colors and these colors include pink, yellow, purple, red, white, orange, and many more. They offer a spectacular display of colorful flowers. The flowers come in clusters and they have a long blooming period. It's a plant that is indigenous to the Mediterranean region and you can plant it in the sun or partial shade. It's a plant that is great for all regions. 7. Phlox Phlox is a herbaceous perennial plant that is grown for the beautiful flowers that it produces. The flowers are usually pink, red, or purple, and the flowers are tubular shaped and can be in clusters. Most of the phlox varieties have a delightful fragrance. Most varieties are fragrant and attract butterflies, and you can grow phlox in the garden or in a container. These plants are hardy in zones 3 to 8. 
Phlox is a very easy plant to grow. It can tolerate different soil conditions and will do well in partial shade to full sun. It's quite an attractive plant to grow in your garden. 8. Swamp Milkweed Swamp milkweed is one of the most popular plants for attracting butterflies, especially monarchs. It grows in clumps and is a perennial that likes to stay in moist areas. The plant grows in partial shade and can grow to be one inch tall. The flower of the plant are pinkish, hollow, and flat-topped. The plant is good for butterfly gardens, wetland restoration, and riverbank restorations. Plants swamp milkweed in full sun. It prefers moist, drained soil. It's also drought-resistant. It can be propagated by sowing the seeds in the spring. 9. Agapanthus Agapanthus or Lily of the Nile is an ornamental plant that blooms flowers in the months of June and July. You should plant these flowers in your garden as they will attract butterflies. In addition to this, Agapanthus is an evergreen plant with leaves that tend to stay fresh for about two to three years. This plant doesn't need a lot of sunlight so you can plant it in shady areas of your garden. It's a very hardy plant and it can grow in almost all types of soil rocky, clay, sandy, and acidic. Since this is a tropical plant, you will have to grow it indoors during the winter. Apart from being a favorite among butterflies, it's also a favorite of bees, hummingbirds, and even humans. 10. The Aster Flower The Aster Flower is the most common type of butterfly flower, and if you want to attract butterflies to your garden, then you want to grow this type of flower. The most common type of Aster Flower is the Aster Trades Conti. This type of flower comes in a variety of colors, including purple and white. The flowers attract butterflies because of their color as well as their aromatic smell. 11. Hollyhocks Hollyhock is a perennial herbaceous plant, and it's easily recognized by its rich and cheerful colors. The flower's color varies from white, pink, red, and orange, and it has a pleasant, sweet aroma that attracts plenty of butterflies. They can attract a wide variety of butterflies like monarchs, queen, gulf fritillary, eastern tiger swallowtail, American painted lady, and pipe vine swallowtail. The plant grows well in full sun. It can reach a height of four to five feet. Some of its common pests include aphids and mites. Final thoughts. In conclusion, the best way to attract butterflies to your garden is by creating a diverse environment. It's important to have a variety of plants in your garden. Butterflies are attracted to different colors, sizes, and shapes of flowers. The list of plants I mentioned is for the sole purpose of providing you with some ideas on how you can attract butterflies to your garden. It is by no means a definitive list of all the plants that will attract butterflies to your garden. It's simply a guide to get you started. I hope you enjoyed this video and we hope you're inspired to add some of these plants to your garden. Be sure to like and subscribe and don't forget that life is always better when you garden.